Sticker-wearing supporters of House Bill 562 sat next to Muslim opponents of the bill, each patiently waiting to testify on legislation that, on its face, seems rather innocuous. It's very simple and straightforward. Plano Republican Jeff Leach says all his bill would do is prevent legal decisions based on foreign laws if, and only if, those laws violate the Constitution. We just want to ensure that, going forward, that any foreign law that's used in our Texas courts does not violate a fundamental right of Texans guaranteed under the Constitution. The bill would affect alternative arbitration courts used by Muslim, Catholic, and Jewish communities for years. Attorney Joshua Houston is with Texas Impact and worries they'd all be negatively affected. I mean, it's just a way to help uh, people in your congregation try to resolve through mediation their marital disputes or adoptions or other kind of family law issues without having to go through the pain and suffering of a trial. Yet Muslims and feel the bill targets them. These laws don't supersede, you can't supersede American law. That's already protected in our Constitution. Aliyah Salem with the Council on American Islamic Relations says some believe incorrectly that Sharia courts are part of a Muslim conspiracy to overthrow the legal system. And the bill plays into those fears. Um, nobody's attempted to do that. Nobody's trying to attempt to do that. This is really a solution in search of a problem. And the, furthermore, with regards to the whole uh, creeping Sharia, as they like to call it, that is impossible. Our Constitution protects from that kind of, I guess you could say, overthrow. Support